Now, NBC5 First Warning Weather with meteorologist Ben Frechette. Well, a nice story there, and let's transition to the nice weather we've been having lately. So nice you could walk along the lake, right? <laughs> Is that what you did today with your dog? I did do that. Lulu did dip her little paws in the water, and she was like, I'm out of there. Too cold. <laughs> yeah, I'll wait until the water's about 30 to 40 degrees warmer before I do something like that personally. But on the subject of the lake, because it's been so mild and dry lately, the lake level has been really low. Today's level was 96.6 feet at the King Street Ferry Dock in Burlington. That's about a foot below normal. And you know, guys, there's not much melting left, not a lot of snow left out there. So record low lake levels later this spring and summer are possible. And I know that has a lot of implications for uh, some maritime industries around here. So that's worth watching as we go forward. We're in the 60s across most of Vermont, 58 right now in Middlebury, 58 also in Saranac Lake, but close to 70 down to the south. And speaking of 70s, we've got a couple of them ahead. I think all the way through Saturday, very mild and dry around here with a few showers possible on Sunday. But right now, the risk for that is definitely on the low side. We'll talk about that in just a second. First, I want to show you Storm Tracker. You can see over our neck of the woods, totally dry, high pressure is in control. That's actually what's going to keep this system well off to the west away from us. It's going to get close, but that high is going to push back on it and keep us dry for at least a little while longer. So let's walk you through the forecast here. We'll start you with the next 12 hours. Temperatures falling through the 50s and down into the 40s tonight. A few passing clouds overhead, otherwise very pleasant, with 40s and 30s expected, basically where we were this morning. And for tomorrow, a noticeable difference, not only with more sunshine, but also with warmer temperatures. I think many of us reaching the 60s and low 70s by the afternoon. We'll call it 71 in Plattsburgh, 66 in, uh, oh, 66 in Plattsburgh, 71 in Burlington. But no matter where you are, I think it'll be a great day to get outside. We'll run this through Friday real quick just to show you we have another beautiful sunny day on the way, but more clouds in the afternoon as that system I was talking about starts to get close. Remember, high pressure is going to push it away, so I think we're just talking clouds early Saturday morning and then a little bit more sun to start off your weekend. Here's the temperature trend. We've got 70s through Saturday and then temperatures dipping as we go into early next week. Still above normal, but this happening because the weather gets a little bit more unsettled. Just a few afternoon showers as we're looking at Sunday. It looked like something more substantial, but the latest model trends have been going drier. So in terms of our drought, not great news there. We could find a couple spot showers on Monday as well. Tuesday looking pretty dry, but Wednesday and Thursday, another system could bring some fairly widespread rain. Still a little early to nail down the details, but guys, at this point, we'll take any drop of rain we can get around here.